Some of the deadliest diseases in the world receive barely any attention in North America. The Neglected Global Diseases Initiative is trying to change that. A group of UBC researchers that transcends traditional groupings has begun that effort by funding a groundbreaking solution to a heartbreaking disease. The World Health Organization estimates nearly 60,000 people die from visceral leishmaniasis every year. Tens of thousands of survivors are scarred for life, with some rendered blind. Led by Dr. Kishore Lasan, the NGDI group is developing an easy-to-use, cost-effective treatment for VL. It's just one of the ways research originating at UBC is truly changing the world. UBC in 2007, and they're the first in Canada, and one of the first in the world, have a policy called the Global Access Initiative. And what that is, is that for certain technologies, they will develop at or below cost for developing world indications. So it's a great opportunity to get UBC technologies out to the developing world and not have the cost to the people that need those medications. We need to do something different. We need to do, look at diseases that are neglected. These are the diseases that have a high incidence around the world. Millions of people are being affected by them. But yet, at the same time, uh, there's not a lot of money. So we started the Neglected Global Diseases Initiative here at UBC. We've got over 300 members, 80 PIs. We've raised about 10 million so far, and we're treating a bunch of really important diseases. Leishmaniasis is a devastating disease. It comes from the sand fly, all right, because there's in developing world countries, all right, there's poor sanitation conditions. So you get the sand fly, which stings you and releases a parasite into your bloodstream that goes to the liver and the, and the spleen. And within several months, if not treated properly, it leads to death. 250 million people around the world are affected by it, primarily in India and in Africa, as well as places in South America. And without proper treatment and accessibility to treatment, people can die within weeks. And primarily, these are young children as well as women of childbearing age. If this product works, it's going to inspire a whole generation of students and young people to get involved in neglected global diseases. So the way you can, you can provide help is not only for this specific project, but to UBC on all the great neglected diseases projects we got going around this campus. It's not, just, it's not just what's happening in my laboratory and our work. It's happening all across campus. And so I would say, if you want to support this particular project, that's great. But if you put dollars toward education for our next generation of students to learn about neglected diseases, to get involved as the future scientists and physicians and pharmacists, I think you, you, the payback will be multiple fold. We're going to be actually treating real patients in the developing world. So, you know, your dollars will make, will make that a reality. That's where we're at right now.